Hi, Chris here from Think Tank, and we're talking about the Video Tripod Manager 44 today. Now, this is a big case. It's built for cinema-sized tripods, stands, sliders, anything that's up to 40 inches long. So, um, it's a really tough build on this bag. We use ABS twin wall, so it's crush resistant, like you can stand on this thing. Um, we also have these shock absorbing wheels that roll real easy over rough terrain. They actually absorb the shock from, from heavy load so it doesn't transfer into the gear inside the bag. Um, and we also put this zipper flap uh, over, the, over the zipper so that it protects the zipper from you know, bumps, scrapes, Anytime you're, you're loading the bag, you don't have to worry about the zipper getting, getting mucked up. So here we have the Sackler 20, and as you can see, it fits perfectly inside the bag. Now we have our, our um, tie-down straps here, and they're locking SRs, and we have these, this is a, a little uh, strap hold-up right there. And then it's a locking cam, so you can adjust it super easy. Because you don't want your straps on the inside of the bag when you put your tripod in. So you have one out and one um, tied up here. And then you pop your tripod in. We have this little padding here so the buckle doesn't scrape your gear. And strap it down tight, depending on the size of your tripod or your stance. So we also have um, uh, bolster cushions here, which can be positioned um, horizontally or vertically, depending on the width of your gear or how many stands you have in here. We also have a, uh, a divider here on the side in case your stands or your tripods aren't quite that tall. You can divide this at the top and then put some tools or um, whatever you want up in the top. So as you can see down in the bottom of the bag, we have a black 420 high density, which is a very robust fabric to be down here with the feet. Now, if your feet got some mud or you're on a location shoot and it's just kind of messy, um, this fabric is very easily, you can wipe it out and clean it up. So as you can see, the lid hinges on the side panel. So it's very easy to get your tripod or your stands in and out. It folds down flat. We also have the, these lid holdup straps so you can work out of the bag easily to grab your, um, your tools or other accessories. We have a small pocket for small tools, but larger tools or even um, spare plates up in some of these, these pockets up here. So let's talk about some, some of the extra features on the outside of the bag. So as you'll notice, there's lots of handles on this bag. We got two on each side, on the top and the bottom, because that way it's much easier to um, load the bag. You know, one person's at the top, one person's at the bottom. We also have single handles on the top and the bottom, but when you have both hands, uh, you know, on either side, it's much easier to grab the bag. So we have user replaceable wheels, um, the feet, the skid rails on the back, all that's used replaceable, so it really extends the life of your bag. Um, I'll tip this up on its side. You can see we have some pretty robust skid rails on the back. And we also have this ID plate here, and that can be registered on the Think Tank website. Um, so that if your bag does go lost or stolen, it's a little bit easier to trace it and track it down. We have an identification pocket at the top here. So you can see what gear is in the bag and which location it's going to, depending on if you have a lot of different gear going to a lot of different locations. That's how you keep organized. Last but not least, we have a pocket in the back here that has a padlock and cable. So you can secure the main zipper sliders and then lock it to an immobile object in case you need to go grab a bite to eat and don't want your gear just sitting out there in the open. So this is the Video Tripod Manager 44 from Think Tank. Um, a durable, rugged bag, um, and great for any gear that's up to uh, 40 inches long. So this is Chris, thanks for watching.